Hey guys, Todd here. Today we're going to install the FIA Universal Bug Screen on this Toyota RAV4. Now, depending on what vehicle you put it on, the installation steps may differ a little bit, but they're all going to be in the same ballpark and be very similar. Make sure you're subscribed to our channel to stay up to date with all the latest content. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we're going to do one side at a time. What you're going to notice, you've got three eyelets. We've also got two size cords, a short cord and a long cord and then also an S-hook. What we're going to do first is take our short cord that's going to go to our center eyelet. We're going to take and tie a knot in it, but we're not going to tighten it up. Just get it nice and loose. And then from the inside, we're going to push through that eyelet and set it in place like so. Then we're going to take the other end, run it through uh, the hoop in the S-hook, and then we are going to tie a knot there. Again, we're not going to tighten it down all the way just yet. All right, and set that to the side. Then we're going to go ahead and take, run this one through this hole. Again, tie a loose knot. This is this way we can come back and adjust these. And then we're going to go through this eyelet and tie a loose knot here. All right, so one thing I want to point out is that our knots are on the inside, so they're going to be between our bug screen and the vehicle. That way, when we adjust it, we can tuck those knots between the bug screen and the vehicle. Now we're going to repeat the same process here on the opposite side of the bug screen. Okay, now that I've got both sides loosely prepped, I'm going to go ahead and fasten the driver's side. What we're going to do is find a good location in the driver's side wheel well to attach this S-hook. Um, every vehicle is going to be different, and this is a universal fit, so just make sure you have a good location. Once I secure it on this side, I'm going to stretch it over to the other side and set it on that side as well and show you how to do the adjustments. All right, now I'm going to make my first adjustment. We'll probably have to make a few adjustments on the way, but I'm going to go ahead and pull this tight this way. And next, I'm going to pull this cord tight. I'm going to redo this knot right here. Next, I can take and pull this cord. I'm going to get this tight around here. And I'll also tighten up this one here. And then I can retighten this knot. All right, now that we've got this set in place, we're going to go ahead and do the same thing on the opposite side. And make sure you adjust it to where it's nice and even on both sides. Well, we've got it adjusted the way we want it. If you do experience it flapping in the wind, you can raise the hood, tuck it in there, and shut the hood on top of it to trap it in place. And that concludes the installation. If you found this video helpful, make sure and give us a thumbs up. If you want to know more about the product, check the link in the description below. As always, if you have any questions, call the experts or visit us online.